Hello everyone. In this lecture, we will learn about tangency constraint using constraints defined in dialog box tool. We can find the constraints toolbar at this location. We can see that this constraints defined in dialog box tool is inactive. This tool becomes active when we create sketched geometry. Let's create a circle using origin as the center point. Now let's create a line little farther from the circle. Let's select this circle and line elements by pressing control key. We can see that constraints defined in dialog box tool becomes active. If we don't select any of these sketched elements, it will remain inactive. Now click on this constraints defined in dialog box tool. Constraints definition dialog box opens up and applicable constraints for these sketched elements become active and others are grayed out. Let's select tangency constraint. We can see that tangency constraint is applied. We can identify tangency constraint by this symbol.